Hi everyone, I'm Russ, and today we are playing Grounded on the Nintendo Switch. We're going to be playing about 30 minutes of this game to just see how it runs, see how we feel, and just see if it, uh, if it's, if it's trash. We're going to do a new game. Hey, Russ plays normal mode, we got to do medium. I'm going to do Pete, car yard, yard. It's perfect. Ah uh, yes, of course, we get the... The opening, I can't tell if this is a pre-rendered cutscene or not. I think it is. Oh yeah, it definitely is. Xbox Game Studios. I don't think that'll never not be weird. Oh my goodness, the frame rate on this is just, it's compressed as heck. I'll just say that. All right, here we go. Oof. Oh yeah, we can We can already tell that the textures are heavily downgraded. Oh my, oh, oh dear. All right, textures are extremely low. Frame rate's obviously split in half right. at 30 frames per second compared to our, our regular our regular 60 frames per second. It, it's, it's, we haven't actually gotten out in the world, but it's looking a little choppy. It's looking a little choppy at first, but I don't want to judge it too hard. <sighs> what, why is that pixelated? All right, let's do this. Uh, it doesn't look like it's running at 1080p. Oh, we got a little, a little aphid. Signal detected. All right, let's go to the signal. We gotta go to this field station. Oof, okay, so we get some, we got a lot of texture popping going on. There's an ant. Hey, buddy. So one thing you should know about me, I'm not a huge, uh, I'm not a huge bug guy. I'm not gonna lie. In fact, I actively dislike most bugs. I'm okay with the small ones. It's the big ones that I'm like, oh, no way. No way, sir, I'm not, not touching, I'm not going anywhere near those things. Look for more science equipment. So I'm gonna just pick up a bunch of these rocks, Five, fi plant fiber, oh, there we go, got a little, got a little got weevil. A no Smash it and get its goop. Now we can harvest, harvest remains, and let's bring it back to the, let's bring it back to the lab. Okay, first of all, the water surprisingly has some reflections. It's not just a sheet of glass. Um, I'm actually impressed. I'm, it's weird, because I'm disappointed yet very impressed. The frame rate has been surprisingly consistent. The, the textures on the ground are all they really need to be. And all the grass is here, all the plants are there. It's actually not that bad. Gotta analyze these resources. Analysis complete. So I have played this uh, for a few hours on the Xbox because I have Game Pass, which by the way, if you have Game Pass, don't get it on Switch. I'm assuming you're watching this video because you're not sure if you should get it on Switch. All I gotta say is if you have Game Pass, buy Game Pass for a month and then play the game that way. Uh, and if you really like it, or you really want to play it handheld, then get the Switch version. At least that's my first, that's my first quick analysis of the game so far. If the Switch is your only option, I mean, hey, maybe, maybe the Switch is like not that bad. Uh, uh, analyze a Peblet. Oh, I didn't. Oh, there we go. Oh, shoot. I didn't analyze the one thing I needed to, which is the Peblet. Now I gotta wait. Now I gotta wait nine minutes. Oh wait, 20 seconds? Anyways, uh, find some, find and eat some food. So I'm following the directions that it's saying in the top left corner, analyze a pebblet at a resource analyzer, find and eat some food, look for more science equipment. Uh, I just gotta, I gotta analyze this pebblet. We're almost recharged, got about 10 seconds left and I can analyze this, this bad boy and get some more brain power. Let me know in the comments if you are getting this game or you want to get this game. Maybe you're unsure if you want to get this game or not, or if you've played it before. Now, one thing I do like about the this version is that you can play with other consoles. So if someone, if one of your buddies got it on Xbox, you can play on the Switch with your Xbox. At least that's what I've seen. Um, I haven't tried it out, but I've, I've, I'm pretty sure it's on the website that this is cross-platform. But I mean, side by side comparison, this looks like garbage. But if we're not doing a side by side comparison, this isn't that bad. Oh, I don't want to slurp nasty water. Um, just collecting some of these. Let's look for more science equipment. Oh, look, we found some. So, all right, so what's this? We got to zap ourselves with. We got to get a little zap going. Oh, here we go. A target. Oh, let's push it. Let's push this button. Uh, okay, something I don't, uh, something I hate. I hate when games on Switch for, swap the B and the A button for jump, and that's exactly what has happened here. The A button is the jump and the B button. What does the B button even do? I don't know, but they're swapped, and I hate when they do that. I like when the select button is A on Switch, but not the jump button. All right, this computer doesn't look that bad. Again, all the necessities are here. This game is the exact same on Switch. It's just not as good looking. Unblock the obstructed laser. There, that laser's good. Where's the obstructed laser? Oh, there's the obstructed laser, covered by that grass. Oh, one, one other thing I noticed is that the 
motion, not the motion blur, the fe depth of field effect. Whoa, look at that ladybug. Do I kill it? Is that actually what ladybugs look like close up? What the heck? How am I, how am I ever supposed to sleep after this? What the heck? Wait, those white things aren't its eyes? My life has actually changed right now. All right, let's move the, the grass that's covering the laser beam. Where is it? There it is. So I think here we have to, we have to smoke it with an ax. We gotta build an ax. All right, so by clicking the minus button, we can go to the craft section, pebblet hammer, pebblet ax, and we have to, so first we need some crude rope. Let's craft them. You craft this by plant fibers. Then we can go over to the pebblet ax and we can craft one. There we go, she's crafted. Now I don't love the navigation bar on controller. It's kind of hard to use. Oh man. All right, now let's cut this down and smoke the obstructed grass blade. We can also get some, we can also get some plant fibers while we're at it. Heck yeah, my boy. And I think, yeah, we can get these planks as well if we're building, uh, but we ain't building yet, chief. All right, we should be good to, oh, this this buddy's blinking. Oh, what is that? Oh, that looks like a honeybee. It looks like this one's not, this laser's not working that well either. So let's, let's head over there. If I do declare and let's see what silly guys we got on the way over here. Can we hit these roots? Well, what's this gonna give me? Nothing. All right, we do need to get some food and water. We're running a little bit low. Good thing, there's some right there. Can I give it a slurp? Jump, yes, a little slurp. All right, here we go. We have to, there's, for some reason this laser isn't, isn't slapping as hard as we wanted to. Okay, I'm actually impressed by the water. It's looking a little weird. I know I've said the water's nice, but it's, it's just nice for switch. Oh, snap, oh, this is why. This is why they're being, this is why the laser's being silly. It's getting covered by these, by these lawn mites. It's like glitching oddly. Smoke, what, is there something hitting me? No! Get the heck out of here, you lawn mite. All right, here we go. Lawn mite, the lawn mites are on these cords and it's looking like, wait, oh, there's one, it looks like a tick. Get him! We are harvesting all of the lawn mites. All right, it's getting a little dark, so it looks like we're gonna, oh my, another one. Heck that guy. Uh, we gotta get a torch. I hope I have enough for a torch in my craft, in my crafting. Am I getting eaten? I'm getting busted again. You've been injured. Craft bandages, bandages to restore health. Oh, okay. Fiber bandage. Oh, I need sap. Where do I get sap? Where in the in the heck and heck do I get sap? Oh, look at that. Speaking of sap. Oh my goodness. I really hope things aren't trying to attack me because I do not have the resources to get attacked right now. Oh, get him! No, 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 no. Okay, I gotta run. I gotta run, I'm gonna die. I just need one more sap to get a bandage. I'm get. am I getting chased? I'm getting chased by two of them! Please, no, please, please! All right, I, I ran away far enough. I just need another thing of sap and I can bandage my myself up. Oh yeah, like I was saying about the uh, depth of field. <laughs> There's like no depth of field effect. There's a heavy depth of field effect on the, on the, uh, the Xbox version, which makes you feel more small. Um, but not, not here. Oh, let's go. I think I, I just ate those mushrooms. So I don't, did that heal me? I don't think that healed me. I don't think this is Minecraft. I'm just trying to find some sap over here. Just a guy looking for some sap. For me, it's just another Wednesday, Tuesday. What's going on? Or should I be looking for this sap? I don't even know. I just found it randomly on like a rock. So look at that. Look at this guy. Oh, look at that beetle. The, it's just, it just disappeared. It vanished. Wait a second. Oh, there's some assets. There's some assets in the game, like rocks, that disappear. Like, look at these rocks. That's so interesting. Obviously, that's the save on the Switch's resources, but, but, huh. So that's how it's saving a lot of these, a lot of these things. Threat detected. No, no, get away from me. I just am looking for sap. I'm just a guy looking for sap. I actually don't know. Wait, was that it? I'm hallucinating. Must have got eaten by a bug. Oh, wait, this is where I started? This is where I started. What the heck is going on? Wait, is that where I started? No, oh, it can't be. Sap gang. All right, make some bandages and use them. Sweet. Uh, all right, now we gotta get back to destroying these mites. So we gotta get a torch so I can go in that cave and wreck those boys. Is there a ladybug trying to attack me? No way. Oh, it's this dumb thing. Get the frick out of here. All right, it is torch time. Now, how do I get a torch? A weevil shield. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know how to get a shield or a torch. Oh. I need to walk in there first and then I can get a torch. <laughs> there you go. No, I need sap again. Ah, shoot. Okay, dry grass chunks. Oh, look at that. Me looking for sap for so long like a loser. 
and there's just two right here. Just casually lay in there. We gotta get some dry grass and we gotta get some plant fiber. Oh, look at that. Wow, there's just a never ending amount of sap now. All right, let's get, let's get this torch. Let's get this torch. Oh, I need crude rope and torch acquired. Ha ha, let's go. Let's get this boy, get wrecked. Let's get this boy and that boy. All right, the, you know, the light, the dynamic lighting in caves, like that's pretty good. Again, I'm not sure what I was expecting on the Switch, but I'm thoroughly impressed that they, I'm impressed that they got this to even run at all. What am I doing? Oh, I have no stamina. If I die, I'm gonna be so angry. All right, let's harvest these boys. Oh my, oh, there's two. Get that, get that guy. Who else? Slime mod, slime mold stock. Also, wouldn't these mites die because they're getting electrocuted by this wire? They must be, they must be some pretty big mites or strong mites. All right, I think I got it all. The Mysterious Machine Part 2, investigate the machine further. So I think that re-enabled the, the big laser boy. So we should be able to go back and enable whatever it is. Ooh, we got a little bit of, we got a little bit of a frame, a frame, a frame goof. I know I will need these clovers because you need clovers to, to do a little sleep time. It is chugging, it's chugging a little bit. But, but it's optimized very well. I did not expect this game to come out on Switch because I thought Hi-Fi Rush was gonna come on Switch before Grounded. I think everyone expected Hi-Fi Rush to come out on Switch. So I don't know what happened there. I, I still hope it does. Oh, all right, here we go. And activate. Oof, the resolution. Oh my goodness, the, the resolution's 10. The resolution's literally 10 right now. What's going on? Oh snap, explosion. Explosion time. I knew it was gonna happen. This is what happens. Eat or die. Oh, I have I have literally 120 seconds to find food. Um, oh wait, I have mushrooms. I literally have mushrooms. Heck yeah! We mushroomed ourselves. All right, let's go to this big this big boy tree and see what that explosion was about. And try not to get caught in any scuffles along the way. Oh yeah. I think I'm, wait, am I going the right way? Yeah, I think that's the tree. Oh wait, unless that's the tree. Oh shoot, what tree is it? This looks like the house. So I think it's actually this tree. My bad. All right. I guess the only scuffles we're getting into is our own. Ooh, ooh, oh, it's, it's an ant. Red working worker ant. Oh, let's get it. Oh, it's knocked out. And I'm out of stamina, so. I'm out of stamina, because I'm a hungry guy. And harvest, oof, and decay. Looks like I'm, is this guy gonna hurt me because I hurt his friend? No, he's jetting. He knows I'm no harm yet. But boy, are they wrong. I'm gonna come back with a, with a shotgun. Oh, something's moving that, something's moving that grass over there. Oh, is that a spider? Oh my, oh dear, oh dear, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh no, please. Oh, please no. Does it see me? Oh my, oh my, this one sees me. Dang it. Oh my, I didn't, oh. Pete was ripped apart by an orb weaver. I thought for sure I could have dodged that boy. All right, now we just gotta go back and collect our stuff. Uh, I don't think we're that far. Oh yeah, only a hundred centimeters away. That's like, that's like three rulers. Oh my. Oh, it's just a little buddy. It's just a little buddy. There's that bozo. What has he got in his, what does he have? What is that? Oh, it's a, I don't know, it's like some sort of, it's coming back. See, they tried to snipe me with uh, with these webs. Let's grab that. Um, Let's just, let's just gun it towards the tree. Oh, is it slug? Slug mode? Someone has become a slug or is hiding in their little shell. I really hope this is the right tree. Just an ant. Oh yeah, this is the right tree. We see some, we see purple smoke. What's good about when I died is the fact that my hunger, my hunger restarted. I'm hearing beeping. Do we need the, do we need these cloves? I don't think we do. I think we got a lot, so we should be good to go. All right, let's see. Ooh, requires a busting tool. Wait a sec, let's get sapped. Where am I supposed to go? Am I in the right place? That house <laughs> has, has a total of three textures on it. Going up to the, we're going up to the purple fire. Oof, what is that? What is this? What in the world is going on here? This isn't just your regular backyard. No siree. Oh, snap. I see some s spooky little spiders in there. Heck no, sir. Let's, all right, here we go. Here's the purple smoke and there's the lab. Let's get in this place. Oof. All right, the uh, the frame rate's a little lower. I think we, oh, all right. I think we just gotta hit this button and the door's open. Oh, oh, no way, I can, let's go, I can take all the sap. Sap boys for life. The controls are a little finicky, not gonna lie. It's a little difficult to get exactly where you want on there. And I've, I can only imagine it would it would be worse <laughs> on Joy-Cons. All right, here we go. Let's keep going. Here's our little, here's our little robot friend. 
I forgot you could play this game in third person. We're helping Burgle. So Burgle's a little robot here. He's gonna help us out. He's also gonna make us go around the map and collect his memories, which have been, get, believe it or not, completely damaged. All right, so now that we've talked to him, we can, uh, we can uh, talk about the biometric scanner and we can start scanning things. Oh, wait, is it the biomet? No, this is the biometric scanner. Anyways, we can pretty much get some raw science by going to all these places and we're gonna go look for some of his memories. Uh, that's what the that's what our next steps are. Oh, look at this. Look, you get all these free supplies. It's blessed. I keep forgetting that the jump button is A. There you go, raw science. So let's just make our way through this little building. We should be good to go. All right, now we're out. Uh, I'm gonna make a lean-to, which is like, it's essentially a bed. It's essentially a bed. Now, it's just remembering how to make it. I think I have everything I need. This is the whole base building. Yeah, oh yeah, we got enough. And then we can do a, yeah, super build. And just build this boy. And then use it, and we can sleep for eight hours. And boom, it's gonna be daytime. It's gonna be daytime pretty soon. Oh yeah, look at that high resolution glory. All right, we slept the first night. That is around the 30 minute mark. We went a little over. So uh, when you play the game around 30 minutes, you should be at this at this stage. I don't ever remember seeing this in the distance because of the heavy depth of field effect. Oh yeah, we can also spend our raw science that we use at the science shop. Yeah, it upgrades what we can learn. So like a smithing station. That is a something we wanna, that's something we wanna learn how to do. Then we can start upgrading our weapon. Cooking 101. We don't have enough, we don't have enough for that. A multi-story basis. Torch upgrade. Meat shield. So pretty much now we just gotta go around, uh, scan some new resources, get some raw science, and we can also collect these floating purple things around the area and also get, there's also a whole, obviously, crafting and base building. Uh, I'm not gonna get into that in this video, but uh, let me know if you're gonna get the Switch version of this game. Oh, look at this, more raw science. Okay, let's go. Uh, yeah, or let me know if you've you've played it already. If you wanna see my full review then look at the look at look at this end screen thing. Full review on the channel Russ Vandy. Thank you all for watching and uh, please consider liking and subscribing. I hope to see you in the next one. See you later.